masks. We all need them. But which one would I recommend? I'm giving you a hint right here. Hey, this is John from Ride Upstate. And I want to talk to you today about PPE, personal protective equipment, that we all as rideshare drivers and gig workers and really pretty much anybody need to use right now. This is the BNX A96 personal particle protective mask. And I got a five pack of these. I've been wearing these pretty regularly. And I tell you, I found out something that these masks compared to those simple disposable ones you get and one of these cloth masks like this, what a difference. This is a KN95 certified mask. So that's almost the same as N95. KN95 is uh, the Chinese specification. N95 is a U.S. specification. They're pretty much the same. The only major difference is the breathability requirements between them. However, BNX has applied for N95 certification, and they're expecting it soon. This is a duckbill mask, so I'm going to show you what that looks like when you wear it. So that's what it looks like. You understand why it's called a duckbill mask? So there's a couple of things that I really like about this mask. Uh, the first thing being it has two straps on it. One goes around your neck, one goes around the back of your head, and it really helps to keep the mask secure. The other thing is the duck bill. One of these masks that sits flat across your face, gets wet, gets moist, you got moisture rubbing all over your mouth and your nose. No good. I don't like that. That doesn't happen with these masks. These masks, they don't touch your mouth, and they, even though moisture can build up in them because of breathing, it doesn't get on your face. So I do like that. The other thing I like is this double wire construction that they have here. If you've ever seen those wide bread tie twisties, instead of having just one wire, it's two wires in between two pieces of plastic. This may even be a flat piece of metal, but I don't think so but it's flat. So you don't have this little thin wire that is making the seal across your nose. They are tight. That's kind of one of the things that eh, I'm a little neutral on. This is a very tight mask, but it's designed to be tight. It is an N95 mask, so it is designed to prevent air from going around the outsides of the mask. The added benefit of that is that your glasses don't fog up as easily because air is not escaping the top of the mask. It's all coming out the front right here. All the air comes in and out through the front of the mask. It does feel a little small on my face. I'm, I have a pretty long nose and a long chin here. So it does feel small and tight around my face. But uh, I have been able to wear this for up to about three hours. Now, that's another thing that I want to mention about this mask. This isn't one of those masks that you just take off and take on while you're driving, while you're doing your deliveries. You're going to want to leave this on. And I did leave it on for uh, an entire shift of delivery, which was about, that one was about two and a half hours. Uh, you're going to want to leave the, the mask on because it's not very easy to take on and off. You got to make sure it's sealed. They have instructions on how to check for a, a proper seal and everything. But all in all, I think this is a great mask. You can find these on Amazon. They are made in the USA. So if you want to support an American company instead of supporting companies that get things made over in China, this is the mask to get. Uh, I would highly recommend if you're concerned and you want to add an extra layer of safety by wearing an N95 or well, KN95 certified mask, versus just a cloth mask or a regular mask. Listen, the vaccine is out. I understand that. But that doesn't mean that you can't still get coronavirus. And you know what? Who knows? Maybe in the future, during flu season, it might not be a bad idea to wear a mask when you're in your car. It's kind of become culturally accepted over in Japan and China. And I, I wouldn't be surprised if it becomes more accepted here in the United States. But the BNX A96 Particle Particulate Protection Super Duper Mask, Duckbill Quack Quack Mask. I recommend that you get it. Check it out. 
And uh, until then, my name is John from Ride Upstate. I'd appreciate your support. There's a Venmo link in the description below if you want to financially support me. Otherwise, subscribe to the channel, like this video, ring my bell, and all those other wonderful things that I'm supposed to tell you here on YouTube. Hey, remember, just because you're in a small market doesn't mean that you need to settle for small profits. Bye.